This is the uh, potato gun cannon. Uses propane, not hairspray. Gives a little bit bigger of a boom. Do a little test fire here. In three, two, one. Switch trodes. Switch the second barrel. Test fire two, three, two, one. Okay, so we've completed the test fire phase. We're going to go ahead and load up an actual round for these Sabre type devices that carry and create a cushion around the round. And uh, we're using pine cones today because that's what we got around. There's lots of them. We take it, load it in each individual target, each individual barrel, roll it over. So here, same thing. Load it into the Sabo, get all the crap off it. Load it into the barrel, push it up in there nice and snug, roll the barrel over, and you're good to fire. And then to fire it, you know, prep each tank with propane. If you've got a stopwatch on the bottle itself, that allows to Right. Right. Propane's filled, we're ready to fire. You notice this time if you watch the gun, there's actually recoil built into each one of these cannons. So that when the round fires, the gun will in fact recoil backwards. Firing tube one, three, two, one. Which an electrode. Good fire tube two, three, two, one. And there you have it. All right, we do a little knife fire here. <clears throat> we got a chem light set up for a tracer round. Tracer round, firing in three, two, one. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah.